Thousands of new jobs coming to Central Florida in the biomedical industry, and it's part of a new medical park. The new Veterans Hospital alone is expected to bring in hundreds of new jobs to Orlando's medical city. Today, more good news. Fox 35 Steve Gelbach explains how the VA will tack on more jobs with a new training and simulation center. Once complete, the new medical city out here at Lake Nona is expected to employ about 30,000 people. The Burnham, you know, is already open. The next to open is the UCF Medical School with this building behind me. And across this field back here, that is the new Nemours Children's Hospital looking about halfway done, set to open sometime next year. And then the year after that, in 2012, the new VA Medical Center will open here at the end of this road here where all these cranes are. And they just made an announcement today that there will be another piece adding on to that. There will be a new site for to train VA doctors in medical simulation. The announcement was made at the Medical City by Congresswoman Suzanne Cosmas. She met with representatives of each of those big anchors of this new biomedical community. And this new training center is expected to bring directly about 12 high paying jobs, maybe even more, paying anywhere from $75 to $100,000 a year. And the Congresswoman says, though, it's the collaboration, the cooperation that should bring even more opportunities in this new key industry for Central Florida. We have a great deal of research and small businesses already operating in the modeling and simulation field. So the idea that we can bring uh, doctors here to train them in modeling and simulation procedures so that um, it's, a, it's a money saver, it's an advancement in science, it's a state-of-the-art opportunity for us to provide for our veterans the best care that they deserve. The hope is even more simulation biotech pharmaceutical companies will be moving out to Orlando's new medical city. In total, expected to have about an $8 billion impact for our area. At Lake Nona, Steve Gelbach, Fox 35 News. If you're looking for a job,